You're watching Local 5 News. We are Iowa. Celebrating great things that are happening around the metro, we want to let you know about an upcoming production at Inkeny Community Theater. So the show is the musical Godspell, a story of eight strangers looking for answers to their lives. And it goes a little bit more into that, and we're going to talk about what that's all about. So joining us today to talk more about this very special production is the musical director, Dan Chase. Thank you very much. Good to be here, Dan. And uh, the gentleman portraying Jesus, Marquise Bundy, is uh, joining us as well. Thank you both Thank for you. being here. Thank um, you for having us. Yeah. Yes. Good to be here. I, I want to start with you, sir, because we've talked a little bit before our interview here today, mm -hmm. and you just couldn't stop talking about how special this production is. It's a classic that people probably recognize the name, but why is this particular production unique? I think it's because it portrays the parables of Jesus, and you can um, take it so many different ways. And the way we have chosen to do this is in a very playful schoolyard manner. Um, and these guys are having so much fun telling the story. And so a lot of it's in their own words. They, they, yeah. They've adapted the scenes for themselves so, to make it a very personal story. And you're also kind of updating we have. Yeah, I mean, it, it's taken, you know, uh, scripture from the actual Bible, but mm -hmm. there's ways of updating that. Can you explain mm -hmm. that a little bit? Well, um, <laughs> perhaps Marquis says a little <laughs> bit, but, but it, um, it, there's some wrapping, um, uh, some crumping, yeah, um, um, all kinds of stuff going on <laughs> that really bring it into a, a very contemporary mode. And the fact that they are, each one of the cast members tells their own individual parable. Um, the parable of the prodigal son, the parable of the persistent widow, the parable of the, the Pharisees uh, questioning Jesus. All of that is brought into a very contemporary style of language. Mm -hmm. um, we haven't stilted it in the Bible or even the original 1970 script. So it becomes a, a really contemporary story. And um, I, I think contemporary, we could use a little peace in our lives. Yeah. Absolutely, mm -hmm. that peace, but also understanding a, a message that kind of goes across time uh, right. like this is a message we can always hear Marquise what is it like portraying I mean iconic you know a, a new face to an iconic character with a very special message with this production it it is so much fun I absolutely love taking on the role of Jesus it um, it allows me to get into the mindset of being open and loving towards everyone which I already am but it just allows me to fully execute that with all of my cast members mm -hmm. on stage um, and exuding the positivity and keeping the morale high has always been something that I'm very good at and so it it was very uh, seamless to step into this role. Yeah. And so I'm, I'm very happy that I have the opportunity to do it. I love it. that. And yeah. if you can't hear just an incredible voice that you know it's gonna be amazing <laughs> as well. Um, is it also fair to say that we need to agree that we're not always going to agree, but there's yes. ways of dealing with that in a, in a positive way so that we can move forward? Absolutely. The first five minutes of the show, um, the prologue in the Tower of Babel is everyone with their own specific ideologies and philosophies quite literally screaming at each other yes. and arguing with each other. And so as soon as I come in, I show them that everyone has their own different perspective on things, but we need to set those aside and come together exactly. to enjoy everyone's company and, and listen to each other in full. So. And stop shouting and maybe bring some peace into our lives. Yeah, I think we can absolutely. all connect with that no matter where you are in life right now. Okay, yeah. we need the details. How and when, where, where do we go to see this production? Okay, so it is at Ankeny Community Theater. Mm -hmm. um, you can buy tickets at ankenycommunitytheater.com. Um, that's R-E, spell it with an R-E. Um, the performances are, we open tomorrow night. Yes. Um, 7.30 <laughs> on Friday and Saturday. <laughs> and then uh, Sunday is a two o'clock matinee. And then same thing the next weekend. We also have a show on Thursday at 7.30. So um, we run for two weeks. Um, tickets yeah. are $15 for students and $20 for adults. So um, yeah. Wonderful. A fabulous message is happening on the Ankeny Community Theater stage. We ask you, even if you think you've seen Godspell, you haven't seen this special And production. one thing to add, too, yes. is Ankeny Community Theater, the space itself is very, very intimate. Mm -hmm. So the audience is practically on stage with us, having as much fun as we are. I absolutely love that. Thank you both Thank for you joining so us today. Break legs. I know it's going to be a fantastic production. Thank you. All right.